Slime molds are fungus-like cells that appear in lawns or gardens to break down bacteria. While slime molds aren't inherently harmful to turf, prolonged activity can choke out grass, and their presence indicates an environment that encourages bacterial growth. In this video, we'll show you how to identify slime mold, reduce the conditions that promote slime mold growth, and prevent slime mold from growing in the future. To shop for the products featured in this video and to learn more about lawn care, click the links in the video's description and get free shipping on your order. The first step in any pest control plan is to identify the problem. Careless identification can lead to the wrong treatment methods, which can cost time and money. In North America alone, there are hundreds of species of slime mold with different appearances. In lawns, you may find slime mold that looks similar to lawn disease. Patches of grass may be covered in pustules. The patches can be four to eight inches in diameter and of different colors, including white, gray, or yellow. Other than patches, you may also find slime mold that looks more like shapeless blobs or dog vomit. These slime mold bodies are known as plasmodium. Plasmodium may rapidly dry out and disintegrate during the mornings, spreading spores through the air. Inspection is the next phase of any good pest control plan. Once you know what to look for, check your property to confirm the pest's presence or find activity hotspots. Slime mold commonly occurs in late summer through fall, but certain species can become active as early as spring. They usually emerge after wet weather in moderate temperatures. When inspecting for slime mold, look for disease-like symptoms in turf or plasmodium blobs. Slime molds also commonly appear in damp mulch, plant beds, and soil, and typically disappear in hot and dry weather. After identifying your pest and inspecting your property, it's time to start treatment. Before starting any treatment, be sure to wear your personal protective equipment or PPE. And remember to keep people and pets out of the treated areas until products dry completely. In many cases of slime mold, chemical control is not necessary. However, you can apply some products to help control slime mold's presence on your property. Check out Monterey Consan 20. Monterey Consan 20 is a 3-in-1 product that works as a fungicide, disinfectant, and deodorizer. To treat lawns with this product, mix 2 tablespoons of concentrate with 1 gallon of water. You'll apply 1 gallon of solution for every 50 square feet. Depending on the size of your treatment area, we recommend you use either a handheld or a backpack sprayer. Use a fan or cone-shaped spray pattern to ensure the grass blades and foliage are evenly coated. Saturate the whole area, making sure to wet all plant and soil surfaces. Apply treatments only when the lawn is dry or damp. Do not apply during wet or rainy weather. Keep people and pets away from treated areas for 48 hours after application. Repeat applications every 10 to 14 days as needed. Prevention is essential to keeping lawn diseases in check. Even after applying fungicides, the best way to stop pest activity is to ensure it can't happen. Cultural practices are the preferred method of control for slime mold outbreaks. Raking is usually enough to break up patches of slime mold and restore your lawn or garden. To further prevent slime mold development, we recommend using regular lawn care techniques to reduce bacterial and fungal growth. Reduce the shade cast on your lawn by trimming overgrown shrubbery and tree branches, rake away leaf litter, and pick up any debris. Regularly mow your grass to its proper height and employ an appropriate watering schedule to provide your lawn with enough water to strengthen its roots, but not so much that will encourage disease. Most lawns require one inch of water every week. Apply the water all at once in the morning so it has time to seep into the ground without evaporating in the sun. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop slime mold from growing in your lawn and we offer fast, free shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos. And contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.